Hello and welcome to whiskey.com where fine spirits meet and today is another scientific video about statistics and whiskey and today it's about the size of the bottle. Does the size of our bottles change? Is there any difference? Hmm, okay so let's look at the chart. Um, we see the chart. Uh, I've um, put the chart down from one liter to a half liter uh, sorry for all you Americans who calculate in ounces, but I think the liter bottle and the uh, 0.7 and 0.75 liter is pretty common in America as well now. So, um, any constrictions here? Um, bottle size. Every bottle in our database has size, but not every bottle does have a bottling year. So we're looking at only bottles with a bottling year. Also, the amount of bottles sold is not taken into account. Yeah, when we see we have a bit of a variation going on until about 1995, that's because of our data shortage of bottles before 1995. There are bottles, but um, there are so few that our data is just not averaging it out as we average the bottle size with the arithmetic mean. Yeah, now let's go to the correlation. We can see a little a little, a little hump going on. We, we rise from 1995 to let's say about 2005 and then falls down a bit again. So why is that? I'm talking about the downfall of size since 2005 and three uh, causations about that. Uh, my first explanation is there is a trend uh, with the new distilleries, the new craft distilleries, that they release their bottles with 0.5 and not 0.7 because they want to sell uh, a bit uh, less expensive bottles with less inside them um, to more people so everybody gets to know their stuff that they are making. Then uh, this next explanation is there is a trend from the duty free buying towards the um, yeah, special liquor stores and special whiskey stores all around the world. And the duty free sell their bottles usually in liter bottles to get just uh, at, to, uh, through, the, through the tax gates and through the toll, I think they call it in English. Yeah. And now they're going to the 0.7 liter bottles that they are usually sold on the normal market or in the special shops like our whiskey uh, shop within Germany. Yeah. Also be careful. This um, is heavily skewed towards the German market. This might not be the same for um, any other market. Yeah. The th a third explanation is a combination of the first two. Um, if you have any other explanation, please feel free to uh, put it in the comments below. If you find anything uh, why there is a rise of, um, of whiskeys from 1995 to 2005 of the size of the bottle, then please feel free to write this in the comments as well. And if you find something very, very logical and right, then please upvote it. And if you think someone is ta just talking bullshit, then download them and we find out what you guys think out there why this is happening yeah thank you very much for watching please feel free to share this video with your friends and see you next time